on top of your television set to explode. Greetings, institutions of the media. We are anonymous. The events transpiring within Wall Street have caught our ride. Hate is on a scale and is growing on a planetary scale of unprecedented size. The violent left is coming to our streets. <laughs> my, little, my little night stick is going to get some more workouts tonight, hopefully. Let's get some things straight here. Pleased to be joined by the very patient uh, <laughs> Congressman Paul Brown, Republican of Georgia, also a medical doctor. We'd like uh, to, to welcome Dr. Brown. Well, Congressman, one last thing. I'm curious to, to, to get your take on what's happening right now. There's a, an Occupy Wall Street. Well, if you look at what they've been telling the media, they don't know why they're there. Just, they're just mad. But this, uh, this attack upon business, attack upon uh, industry, attack, attack upon freedom. And uh, I think that's what this is all about. <laughs> that is so not what I'm talking about. Now, let me tell you what they're talking about. They're, they're complaining about the fact that Wall Street wrecked the economy three years ago, and nobody's held responsible for that. Not a single person has been indicted or convicted for destroying 20%, 20% twenty percent of our national net worth accumulated over the course of two centuries they're upset about the fact that wall street has iron control over the economic policies of this country and that one party is a wholly owned subsidiary of wall street and the other party caters to them as well that's the real truth of the matter as you said before and get the yeah. man a bondo drum they found their spokesman okay take another look at that unprovoked police brutality the reason that man is being assaulted by the police is because of what he has in his hand. He's holding a professional grade video camera. Is that what makes you feel big? Pushing little boys around. USLaw.com has posted a slow motion version of the pepper spray incident. Really? 